again this is tricky this is not theta but a b and c are positive integers such that a b equal to 432 b c equal to 96 c must be less than 9 just after reading this one what will come in your mind if c is less than 9 means c is having restrictions if c is having restriction means b c is having restrictions a b is not having restrictions but based on the a b whatever value b you will get that is going to affect your bc and bc is having certain restriction based on the value of c means 432 in how many ways we can write in the form of two factor product that is only a issue just will apply little bit algebra concept the smallest possible value of sum any summation if you want to minimize any summation if you want to minimize a plus b plus c then what is the best possible way it will be minimum if a equal to b equal to c we know this method just reverse of that also is there if you want to maximize then a into b into c for product here summation a plus b plus c will be minimum if a equal to b equal to c but here a equal to b equal to c is not possible because constant is there and what is the next possible way we will just try to keep as much as possible a a and b are near to each other a b c are near to each other c we can't control because c is having further restriction it is less than 9 and what we'll do only thing we can do we can take the appropriate value of b this is only crux of this question we have to take the value of b near to as much near to b near to a then it will give you the minimum value of abc 432 how we will just check how we will take nearby value vedic math multiple time vedic math will apply approximate a square number how much it will be 21 square is 441 am i right 21 square is 441 means number will be near to 20 if you don't if you are not applying this one then what will happen again you will start to write 1 into 432 2 into 2 again you will waste time and this counting will puzzle your brain it will not give you positive energy it will give you negative energy then around 20 only you have to think no need to go here there around 20 just to think 20 to 20 400 21 into 21 441 around 20 only we have to think between 20 to 21 but here integer value we have to take no fraction value if it is given not given integer value then question would become much difficult many of multiple option could be there but here just we will look 18 and based on the unit digit we will able to factorize 18 into 24 i think that is 432 now between 18 and 24 which one will be b which one will be a this will depends on the value of c this will depends on value of c because bc is equal to 96 it must be in the form of 18k or 24k 18k it is not possible it is in the form of 24 only 24 into 4 means b equal to 24 c equal to 4 then a equal to 18 now we can just add 18 plus 24 plus 4 how much will how much it will come 46 correct now we will now 